what's up guys i'm here today to do a video on why muslims matter and 10 things that you use every single day or maybe not everyone uses every day but some like most people around the world use every single day and for daily basis and if so i want to be showing this video to you guys today and so hope you like it so let's get back into it straight now so the first thing on the list is coffee do you know a Muslim made coffee? He invented coffee. He discovered it. Yeah, his name was Khalid. Yeah. He discovered coffee and then he told everyone else about the coffee that everyone else was staying awake with coffee. So uh, he, he made like a mixture of it that you could drink and then obviously we call it coffee nowadays now. So yeah, with coffee. And second on the list is clocks. You guys use clocks every single day to look at the time, to you just to do everything. Everything is based around clocks and time nowadays. And time came through clocks, so we Muslims invented time for you guys. That guy's name was Ajazi. He was from South Turkey. So if you guys said that Muslims are from Pakistan or Afghanistan, no, around the world, South Turkey, Turkey boys. Third on the list is camera. We use cameras to do everything. I'm using camera right now to record my vlog and this video. And you guys do probably take cameras, take selfies, uh, pictures, videos, everything. Yet the first Muslim that discovered cameras and even made one in the science experiment. To show everyone. He rejected the Greece, Greek people, said to him, no, your idea is wrong. And the scientists proved it to them. And this is how the camera came to use. Fourth on the list is universities universities were discovered by a woman so yes a woman muslim muslim did this she discovered the universe first university and then she spread it around everywhere so it wasn't uk it wasn't america who chose universities it was actually a muslim who found discovered the first university and opened it for herself and other people could come and learn this stuff fifth on the list something that everyone doesn't use every single day Always, people do use it every single day but operations in hospitals surgeons people a Muslim invented the first he invented like the surgical operations and uh, he was the first one to take an operation through someone's actual body and his name was Abdul Qasim so yeah he was a Muslim like I said before sixth on the list is algebra you, did you guys know that algebra would, comes from an Islamic country and a Muslim made that? He, he, you guys learn it in maths every single day or whoever goes in high school, college, whatever, if you're doing extra maths, yeah, you, you learn algebra. Did you know that Muslims invented that? You guys might hate it, but obviously it comes through everyday life nowadays, so it's worth it. Seventh on the list is something that you guys should be using every single day and you most likely do as well shampoo a muslim created shampoo in the old old time where the arabs used to live first they made shampoo where you can wash your hair and we do that same thing now as well they we were the first people to make shampoo imagine not having shampoo in the world uh, hair stronger and clean for us as well so give thanks to muslims Eighth on the list is toothbrush. I hope you guys use this every day. Obviously, you do twice a day. So yeah, a Muslim created toothbrush. You might not having a toothbrush as well. Are you gonna be brushing your teeth with something else? No, you won't. You you wouldn't even be brushing your teeth. Your teeth would be yellow, unless you got white teeth. White or something. Like that. Yeah. So if yeah, the Prophet actually created this because he told everyone to use the miswak. It's like a twig where you can brush, clean your teeth with. So that came through to toothbrush. But people still use must wax nowadays uh, from different trees and uh, it just clean your teeth exactly like a toothbrush but without toothpaste. But it's still the same kind of thing. Now to the list is maps. You guys use maps probably all the time. You guys learn it in geography, you guys have it on your phones nowadays. All the maps came from Muslims. Muslims made the first maps coming through. They 
I had to coordinate the styles going around. We obviously need to travel somewhere or go somewhere. These are your maps. And most of them are the first people to make maps. And tenth and last for the list is flying machines. To the Muslim who designed the first flying machine, it failed. But he was the first person to actually try it and design it himself. So that's how everyone else, all the other people came and uh, started using his theories of a flying machine and did that. Alright, I'm going to wrap up this video now. hope you like this video. I hope you learn a lot about Muslims and you hope... I hope you guys stop hating and just keep up the love for Muslims and but yeah that's the 10 things that why Muslims should matter and things that you guys use every single day and if we didn't have what would you guys be doing without it so like subscribe and leave a comment for me for feedback and I, I got a lot of you guys saying that uh, I should do the gaming video do game uh, but I won't be doing a separate gaming ch channel I'm going to be doing the same channel but just upload different day than another so from next week I'll be posting Mondays I'm posting a gaming vlog on Wednesday I'm be posting a topic like I'm doing today and I'm on a on a Sunday, I'm posting a random video. Like uh, anything that you guys want, just text me, leave a comment below, tell me what you want to see, and I'll just do that. I'll do it. So keep liking my videos, keep subscribing, and thanks. Bye.